there. And that ain't going nowhere. And goes the fertilizer into the back tank. Chevy all restocked, ready to go. We just wanted to pump oh, a little more fertilizer in to match that tank there so that we can run it all out together on Howe Road or somewhere is about uh, together so that way we can go out to Atwater with a fresh start. Was planning on planting today Started beans last night, little six acre by the house. But if it keeps this business up, we might be shut down. I mean, it is just, there's a drop hitting me every, every three seconds. It's just a light mist. But if the sun comes out around say, 11 12 o'clock or so and dries things up we might be able to plant corn tonight if it does this all day we might be shut down who knows only one person time to restock the fertilizer truck so that way it can go out to the field uh that skid's the first one we're going to be using, and then this other skid is a different variety. So, what I'm making do is just slow going, but we're making it. Rained a little bit this morning, but might be able to plant tonight. We're not sure. And goes the fertilizer into the back tank. Chevy all restocked, ready to go. We just wanted to pump oh, a little more fertilizer in to match that tank there so that we can run it all out together on Howe Road or somewhere is about uh, together so that way we can and go out to Atwater with a fresh start. Was planning on planting today. Started beans last night, little six acre by the house. But if it keeps this business up, we might be shut down. I mean, it is just, there's a drop hitting me every, every three seconds. It's just a light, missed but if the sun comes out around say 11 12 o'clock or so and dries things up we might be able to plant corn tonight if it does this all day we might be shut down who knows only one person so I could I don't know if we're gonna be able to plant today or not it it has stopped raining but I mean it only rained maybe I don't know I shouldn't say rained it more just like drizzled from the time we got back with the Dodge tool truck from putting a new squeeze pump hose on the corn planter because the one had a hole in it i mean it's now just a skosh after 11 and it looks like there might be some sun trying to peek through but I'm not too sure so i guess a good job uh well we got some downtime is we're gonna change out this water for the ducks because they are not happy that their water is dirty so we're just going to find a plug 
should either be on the side of the thing or on the bottom. I do not know. This is, oh wait, there it is. There it is, right here. I find it. What you do, you just unscrew him and let the dirty, let the dirty water out. So it'll take a little bit and then um, we will replenish it with clean, fresh water. Should have a long enough hose to come out of the Farrowin house. And, oh yeah, we're gonna be good. Well, I know we're good, it's just, how good? <clears throat> oh yeah, we got more than enough. So, next order of business is get rid of this end here. And we will uh, go ahead and shut the water off. Unscrew our end, should turn the water back on and let it fill up because, well, it'll take a little bit to fill it. I wanted to run the manure tank, just suck the water out, but there wouldn't even be enough water in this thing to fill the suction hose. So what difference does it make? you know just it all just runs in the pit anyhow so pump it out later so now the little snots are trying to drink out of it oh, why are you trying to do that i'm trying to change your water what what the heck we tried making the little step for them to get up out when it comes time for them to get up out and we did something over here similar to that kind of just trying to take the garden hose and rinse all the dirt out of it it's got a plastic liner in it So that way it can be easily moved about the farm or wherever you, you need to move it. face and nobody wants to get a bath. <laughs> I 
Something's wanting to spin inside. Need to get this garden hose in loose. So that way I can not have to stand here all day babysit the thing because, well, 10 minutes of my day. looking at Get out. They are all patiently waiting for the pool to be filled filled up. Plus it gives them, you know, water to drink too. They'll probably end up drinking it rather than playing in it, but Hey, it is what it is. You guys got water over here. You can drink. That one's still full from this morning. I don't know. Maybe ducks like steady flowing water. Ducks are all new to us. That end went back together so easy. All it was just a matter of pushing it back in. And it don't leak. Good job. Good fix. I think I might have just heard a big splash. I did. was no way shape or form being hard on the machine by banging the bucket getting all the sticky manure out of it going to these sand and gravel pits you watch them loader operators i'll bang the bucket when they get done loading the truck with topsoil or fill dirt they'll bang the bucket or else they'll hang they'll flip the bucket over while they're traveling down the road so that 
as they're bouncing over ruts and everything hopefully that sticky material will exit the bucket sun decided to come out let's go work us some ground such a beautiful day out turned out cruddy this morning but it's a beautiful day today this afternoon oh such a beautiful day to be working corn ground out here in this 100 and, what is it 150 acre field or so be out here for a couple days pulling this tool around so when i get up to that oil, oil well tank up front i will just hook that and take that all the way up to the road and that'll be just a little bit out to work from the oil well tank that way I will do that first after I draw my line that way so that that way I can get all the little bull crap done and then uh, let her rip out in the big field here this is the field where this will be our second year farming it um, when we acquired this field, hang on, Barry, gotta go across the driveway. Wow, rough. Okay. And then I will just continue straight. I'm thinking kind of right there. So line the hood ornament up with an object, and we'll stick with that object. So what I was saying was, last year was the first year that we farmed this farm um, and let me tell you it was rougher than um, rough can get for a field um, and the only way we could smooth the thing out was to use that discovator that hated tool that brings every rock up on this green earth and lays it on the top of the surface for yours truly to pick up okay now do I like picking up rocks mm, it's okay but um I would rather pull a colder packer behind me and pound the smaller ones back in the ground where they belong. Um, it's just how I'd like to do it. Maybe a land all or, or something in the future um, would be the way to go. So I'm gonna get this little piece here, this little triangle done, work that up there as well. I'll just work my way right on through the waterway here just kind of go a little slow here because I'm unsure of any washouts or anything in it and then we will get back up to a comfortable seven and a half seven eight mile an hour and work his corner off like I said this would be one heck of a nice field if we didn't have these waterways to bounce through. There's no sense in picking the tool up to go across the waterway like this because you wouldn't get the tool up out of the dirt fast enough before it'd be time to put it right back down again. Hence to why I'm turning right here. So that way I'm not beating my brains out going across the driveway. Just to um, not pick the tool up. 
I uh, just like doing it this way. It's easier. It's easier on me, and it's easier on the tractor too. I wish these things would go away, but they're necessity for water runoff. Okay, now I can go straight. See if I make this little hiccup here. already tell from here that it is not the world's straightest but hey it is what it is so yeah we'll catch you guys in the next video uh, thanks for watching hey at least we're going at an angle so that way when your plant going with the driveway you don't get mixed up in the, where the Salford went I think it's time for some lights Wow them things are bright Wow them things are a lifesaver